Hi, my name is Ruben Alves, I'm from Robot Ignite Academy, and today you are going to answer this question. Visualizing the real-time trajectory path using markers. Here the user says, I'm trying to publish a list of markers based on the data from a message subscribed. I'm not able to visualize it in RVs. So, this is his code. In order to answer this question, you are going to use Robot Ignite Academy. Let much let me launch here a course to have the ROS environment running and okay you are going to use this code and see why it doesn't work let's wait until order okay it's loaded and okay loaded let me close here the instructions okay in order to use his code you need to create a package Let's create here a catkin create a package. Let's call it a tutorial. And it should be listed here on the code editor. Okay, it's already here. Let me create here a source folder now, SRC, and create a file called uh, my marker. Just marker. Marker. It's a Python file. And let's paste his code, this one, and see why it doesn't work. Uh, and okay. If checking here, we have an init method, so it should be on a class. And if we check here the code, we have here a class called trajectory interactive marker. Let's create here his class. Class. Okay. And. We have to import some some classes. We are using Python, so you are being env Python, and let's import Raspi because here it's using Raspi. We have to import also twist stamped. This is in the geometry messages. Geometry messages. We have to import also marker in visualization messages package from visualization messages marker. We have to import also pose pose. Okay, let's import pose vector tree header color RGBA and here pose. Vector tree, vector tree, header. This header is on the standard messages package from standard messages import header. And color RGBA is also there. And quaternion is on this geometry. Let's see if you have to import something else, point and pose. Here we have the pose and point. Okay, in this code the user is trying is, is subscribing to this topic and when a message is received, this event in callback is called this function. Then at the end he calls this show testing in RVs that basically publishes a marker. So since I don't have this topic here. Let's see here our topics. What's topic list? I don't have a topic with arm or something. So for that I'm going to create a topic here. I can just uh, ROS topic public on the topic named let's say tutorial. It's going to be a standard message string and the data is going to be hi. And Let's publish two messages per second. Mm. What's wrong here? Command not found. Data high. Has top key public. Publish. Mm. I don't know. Okay. It's working, it should be publishing. If you check here, ROS topic echo tutorial. Okay, here we are receiving the message, two messages per second. 
So, instead of subscribing to this topic, we are going to subscribe to my topic just because I don't have this topic here with this kind of message twist stamped. So, I'm pasting his code here and change the topic name to tutorial. And the message is going to be string. So, we have to import from the standard message package here. It's going to be string. And when we receive the message on this event callback, we don't have this twist message anymore. So, I'm com going to just comment this line. And this A variable, that's a list, I'm going to assign here the, the position manually. So, for example, x1, 1, 1, 1. It's okay. It's three values here. And it's going to publish on the visualize, visualization marker. And in this frame ID. Okay, this frame ID. If you check here, ROS run. Let me enter the Catkin workspace tutorial just to have the PDF file here. Now we run ROS run TF view frames. Mm, let's wait for five seconds and you will have a PDF file. Okay, it's already here. We can download this file. And here we can see the links that we, 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 we can use here. In this case, the user was using army link 5, but we don't have this link here. So I'm going to use, uh, I don't know, this Hokuyo laser link. This Hokuyo laser link. And okay, let's try to see if it's working. If you enter on the source folder, we can run the marker. Our is this file here, this one here, marker. Let's run this code. Mm, okay, it's it's working. It seems to be working, but we don't have any feedback. So, when the marker is published, let's print here a message: rospy login info message published, and see if it's working. And marker published. Okay, it seems to be published. This is published on this visualization marker topic. So let's try to see if it, it's really publishing. Host topic echo visualization marker. And yes, here we have the messages. As we can see here also with this command. Mm, okay, you are receiving. Yeah two messages per second. It's okay. It's publishing. Now let's see it on RVs. Let's run RVs, RVs, because the user wants to see these messages in RVs. And in order to see RVs, let's open here the graphical interface to the graphical interface. Let's here, wait. Okay, here we have RVs. Now let's add here a marker, marker, okay, here we have it, marker, and let's see if the message is going to be received, if not, we should see an error here, mm, let's see, no message being received yet. Uh, but here we can see host topic echo visualization. Yes, it's receiving. So, why not? Mm. Yeah, I have tested this before and it takes some time to receive the message here. I don't know why, but it was taking some time. Okay, now we have the messages. And here we have error messages because it's red and the status is error, as you can see here. And the error here is... Uh, okay, there is no translation, uh, I mean, there is no... What's the word? Transform from this link that I have used here. This link. This Hokuyo laser link to the link called the map that is the basic the fixed frame fixed frame map so oh my god what 
what I have done here. Uh, okay. Mm, so if we check here, the map, okay, the error is because there is no Hokuyo laser to the map. If we check here our frame is PDF file that we have generated here, we can see here the tree. We don't have here a map, as you can see, there is no link named map. So instead of map, we are going to use world, for example, uh, as the fixed frame. Instead of map, let's change here to world and let's disconnect and connect again just to see if the message oh here we have the, the the we are not receiving error message anymore just uh, the last error message id was 278 and here is our our i mean our marker if we change here the the base link, we will see it in another position. Let's change to Hokuyo laser link. Okay, it's on the zero. So as you can see, it's working. The problem with this user is probably because the the fixed frame is not correct, or the the frame used here is not correct. So it has to generate this frames pdf file with ros run tf view frames and use the right frame and also it has to make sure that the the messages for example this visualization marker is only published when a message is received on this topic in the case of the user is this topic here it has to make sure this topic is being published is publishing for example uh, if we check here, ignite, we have here the message is being published, but what happens if I cancel my topic here? As we can see, we are not receiving more messages. Just stop the here. In this case, the laser also is not going to publish. For example, if you check here, visualization marker, we are not going to receive anymore because, as you can see, so the user have to make sure this topic is publishing. There is someone publishing this topic. Okay, as we can see it worked. We just have to use the right frame ID here and the right topic and make sure the topic is publishing. And here would it here we have it working. I hope you guys enjoyed the video and if you liked the video, don't forget to subscribe our channel. We are publishing videos every single day. See you!